we knew you before you got the success, before you got on 30 Rock and things took off for you. We knew you because you would come by and you would do bits for us on the show, yes, the old late night show. Yes, and um, I'm just curious, what we used to notice back then is that you were quite thrifty. You were quite careful with money because you weren't making a lot and you be. had to be. Yes, sir. Yeah, but you haven't really changed that much, have you? No. No. <laughs> No, old habits die hard. I, I don't. I, I mean, that's a good thing to be. It's good to be well, yeah. careful. Well, I yeah. Think. I don't like spending money willy yeah. nilly. All right. Well, <laughs> <laughs> willy nilly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> My children might be watching. Watch your language. Um, <laughs> is it true that you uh, mention stuff on television sometimes so that you can get it for free? Not so that I can get it for free, but that is the result. <laughs> <laughs> In the hopes. Not in the hopes. Well, what, well, okay, like, what have you gotten? Well, sometimes I tell, you know, people like you that I love Bud Light, which is true. It is true. <laughs> and then they give you Bud Light. <laughs> and you have a soft drink. You have a special soft drink that you really love. What's that soft drink? I know. I drink Mountain Dew like it was a contest. But <laughs> yeah. Which is probably, you know, I'm a grown man. Grown yeah. men don't drink Mountain Dew, but right. it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Just say it to that camera, it's real good. <laughs> Y'all, Mountain Dew, it's real good. <laughs> <laughs> Here's what I like. <laughs> you, uh, it's, and this is sweet. Why don't you tell the audience, because I talk to celebrities every day and a lot of them drive fancy cars. What do you drive? Seriously, honestly. I drive a 2004 Hyundai Accent. <laughs> Good for you. That's great. 2004. And where'd you get the car? From Enterprise Rental Car. <laughs> you bought a car from a rental car company. I did because they they sell it for cheaper and they don't haggle. And I don't like to haggle. You don't like to haggle. So you just said I'd like to buy this car. Yeah. It just comes with the price and you pay that price. Right. And it didn't bother you. How many miles were on it? I mean, if it was a rental car, did it have like a couple hundred thousand miles on it? No, not even. I think it only had 400 miles. And you know what? Right now, it only has 39,000 miles on it. Right. Would you like another car? <laughs> right to camera. <laughs> <laughs> it should be that. You're pretty good at, uh, we've hung out some. I know that you, uh, you like to cook relatively inexpensive treats for people. Is that fair to say? Prepare treats. I don't cook to save my life. I get mad that I have to pour cereal in a bowl. Right. But uh, <laughs> yes, now you say inexpensive, but I say novelty treats. Um, I do have a recipe, may I share? Yeah, this is for a tiramisu I heard, which is a very hard dish to make, I think. Usually. Yeah. With white trash tiramisu, it's a snap. <laughs> what, what is white trash tiramisu? How do you make that? It's so dumb. It's, uh, you get a box of Twinkies and you put them at the bottom of a casserole dish, pour some amaretto on top of that, you mix up a thing of vanilla pudding, you put that on top. Did you say pudding? <laughs> you did. That's not me, you said pudding. Pudding. Okay. <laughs> Tub of Cool Whip, you crush up a Heath bar and squirt some Hershey syrup on there. <laughs> wow. It sounds good, actually. Real good. Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to see even more great Conan clips. You may now return to your pirated movies and creepy Japanese pornography.